Hi all folks, this is Max from ZetoMax.com and the HTCEvoHacks.com so I've got the review of the Exron Speedy port um, this is the latest version um, it comes with a bunch of cool stuff it comes with two free Wi-Fi tethers the Hack Sprint Hotspot and also the free Wi-Fi tether app um, both work as a uh, not as ad hoc but the other type uh, anyway, let's go review it. Um, let's go get a closer look. So here's a quick rundown of the new Exron Speedy ROM. Um, it comes with uh, the latest 2.3.3. I'll show you the software information. Uh, HTSense 2.1, 2.3.3, and also the kernel is based on the latest 651.2. Um, so everything's pretty much working. This is a pretty good ROM. Also, this ROM comes with Sprint TV. Um, if you like Sprint TV, you will like this ROM, of course. And you can watch programs like SpongeBob, SquarePants, uh, which is kind of cool for your kids. This ROM also comes with a Netflix app, and you can resume your Netflix shows on your Evo, of course. So here's Popotan, Secret House. All right, so Netflix works. And how about some Limpack testing? We'll do single thread first. Get 35.047, 35.735, which is not bad. Let's run multi-thread. Multi-thread 30. I think multi-thread is actually only good for dual-core processors. So, Limpack isn't too bad. This one is also based on the Speedy Shift uh, port ROM, so um, it's similar to the other uh, Ginger Mick, uh, Mick G, and uh, the other one. Anyway, I've tried installing kernels, overclock kernels before. That's the only drawback, um, but really the Evo runs fine on its 1 gigahertz, and these ROMs are pretty fast, so I wouldn't worry about it. But if you worry about your Sprint Zone and also Netflix, then definitely this is a great ROM to get. And it does come with the HTC Hub, which some of you might enjoy, and NASCAR. Um, I know some of you can't live out live without a NASCAR. There's Sprint Football Live, Sprint Radio, Sprint Mobile, Sprint Hotspot, uh, ROM Manager, everything you need. Um, it's a pretty good ROM. I've reviewed it before. Now it's even better. So um, Sprint apps, or if you need, if you don't need Sense 3.0, which I don't, um, this is a great ROM to get because everything you need uh, for Netflix, media streaming, and stuff. The only thing that's not working is ACMI output. Um, if you don't use that, or ACM, AC, ACMI mirroring, um, if you don't use that, you should be fine. So that's the review of the Speedy Shift port ROM, the Xron ROM. Um, I'll have downloads below, and don't forget to subscribe, and leave your comments on uh, what kind of ROMs you want me to review next, um, and stuff. Any comments, I'll try to do my best. So thanks, y'all. See y'all later. Oh, yeah, by the way, my, um, my Galaxy Tab 10.1... Uh, Ubuntu video got posted on Engadget. Hooray, yay. Alright, see y'all later. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button right here. Where's it hit? Right here. Thanks.